Welcome back to STG TV, everybody. It's your boy Salute the General here with the homie Joe Ray. Check out The Walking Dead, season 11. Episode 18. Let's get it. The people who go. Like that. Gone. Yeah. Chick Hair. Oh, that was your boy right there, man. Rick. Glenn. Glenn. They don't even show Glenn no more, man. They just showed him, dummy. Not like that, man. Hold it right there! He's framed him and everything. The only thing I ever see is the eyeball hanging out where he's just still sitting there. And you know they can't now. shoot. See? I knew it. No, not slice it. Stab him. No! Damn. What the fuck you just do that with? You heard him. Lower your weapon. Choosing this piece of shit? If I was, you'd already be down. Do what you fucking gotta do. Carol. Oh. What have you done? Hey, Dolores. Hang him on the wall. Put him on the wall. I would have scarred up his other cheek. That took his eye. Fair enough. Ah! Or a ah! hand! I'll take that back. It's an apocalypse. Okay. I like it. I approve. Don't we worry. had to get some kind of damage. Uh -oh. I approve, Daryl. He don't got his Rambo blade on him no more. He got plenty of other ones. Man, I used to have one like that. It had a little compass at the end, top of it and shit. Yeah, he, I knew he was going to do something. Little compass this joint spin off and hand off. Yeah, he took that. Yo, it was like it cut, like <laughs> cut his shit up. Yo, <laughs> oh, I approve of that shit. That's what he said. Yeah, he should have just cut his whole butt. Go on here to here. Uh, his fingers. I wonder how much they pay to be a uh, zombie extra. The Walking Dead extra. Probably not that much. You tell the people what he did out here, back at that house where those folks died. He takes the fall for it. So this is about saving his son. It's not a problem anymore. Yeah, well, y'all give a shit about that place. Get the fuck out of there, right? Because there's a lot of people there still, man. Ain't there, people. So? If they want to come, they can come, right? <laughs> if they want to stay, they can stay. Fuck them. I think the most important thing is that we're together. See? I don't want to go it alone anymore. I don't trust them, but if you say that this deal gets us back in our homes with our own rules, then I think it's worth the risk. Y'all already gave up Hornsby, so there ain't nothing you can do. Uh, ain't got no more leverage at all. <laughs> so take the deal. Don't eat that poison apple. You might shift to me over a few feet. Oh, it's the axe. I'm stuck on an anthill here. Better hop to it, soldier. It's hard as shit. Hold on. You might survive this if you play things right, but your life at the Commonwealth is over. After all you the years, after all that I've done in service of you. Oh, please. You've served yourself above everything and anyone else. <clears throat> See, I'm shaking. It's not going well. He's gonna kill her. Angry, delusional little boy left. Trying to win a game. Too foolish to realize that you've never actually been a player in this. Mm. Say it's her brother? No. Her son? Her cousin? Uncle? Yeah. They grew up like as a kid together or something. You dead, bitch. Whatever game you're playing, Pamela, I'm very much in it. Would you ever consider it? Change of scenery. You show me your home, I can show you mine. 
Mm. He just wants it. <coughs> that's right, that's her brother. Oh yeah. What's the same? Oh, yeah. Take happiness wherever you can go. And don't ever be sorry for it. Hell no. Word. <clears throat> Why Judith look all mad, yeah? Hmm? Why Judith looking mad? Yeah, before you Is she leaving? Oh. Yes, Judith. Real crimes. <laughs> yeah, she's still mad. <laughs> Come on, Judith. Damn. Fine. Change yeah. your mind. I got it for you. Or, yeah. My mom talked about the day she'd hang up her sword for good. Not that we'd be completely safe, but enough to feel like she didn't need it anymore. If I keep that, things go back to how they were. But they should be better. Okay, Judith. Yeah. And what about everyone else here? Shouldn't we stay and help them? Isn't that what you and Mom and Dad did at Alexandria and Hilltop? No, it's different. It wasn't. The only difference now is that you'd rather run away than stay and fight. God damn it. Stop. (laughs) Stop. Don't you talk to her like that, Daryl. Stop. <coughs> Word, just give them an option at least. You know what I mean? Give the people an option, right? You want to come, you come. If you stay, you stay. We ain't leaving Judith behind. Nah, we ain't talking about Judith. She got to go. <laughs> she can't make that decision yet. Word. You're not coming, are you? If it's about the treatment, I have plenty of medicine to make sure of it. Maybe, maybe Tommy can come. It's not that. But this place, these people. Mm-hmm. Give me a second chance to do a whole lot more. So that's what I'm looking for. <laughs> I ain't gonna cry on this shit. <laughs> I don't need this. I won't leave because I'm a Milton. You have jeopardized enough with your stupidity. They need to see that you have nothing to hide and be reminded that you are his grandson. I am. Then show them. Show me. You piece of shit. Step your bitch ass up. It's all getting too real for you? No. Mother and Israel. Oh, mm. Bash that baby's head in. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, they named the baby Glenn. Because it's a sin. It's not us. He not going it's definitely gonna make it. He got a spin-off show coming. That's why he don't make it. Better go apologize to Judith for raising your voice, man. Just a cut. Oh shit. Suppose so we're about to go do some dirt. He's leaving. I'm out long. RJ, where's Judith? I'm not supposed to say. Where'd she go? I don't know. He lying like shit now. Word. And the yogurt's ass. You just told him I wasn't supposed to say. I'm not supposed to say. Now you don't know. Now you don't know. 